Well, it's become a hot tax freeze. Today, St. Louis County Executive Sam Page updates the senior property tax freeze in the county. Fox 2's Chris Renier live in Clayton this morning looking at how many people have already applied for this program so far. Chris? A lot, Blair. Good morning to you, John. Good morning to you as well. You know, the senior property tax freeze has just seen a tremendous response since the applications opened back on October the 1st. We are just outside the main county building here on South Central. This is where County Executive Page is going to update the public on this program a little bit later this morning. It is also one of the locations where you can apply for the freeze in person. Take a look at the video we captured earlier this month. People waiting quite a while, sometimes just hours, to apply in person for the freeze. You can also apply online one week into the process back on October the 7th, the county releasing information saying it had already received more than 10,800 applications for the freeze. More than 9,200 of those had been submitted online. To qualify, you have to be 62 years old and own your property by the end of this year. The property you are applying for has to be your main residence and properties owned by a business or a corporation do not qualify. You can apply in person at four different locations. Those are here at the county government headquarters at 41 South Central Avenue. You can also go to the Northwest Crossing at 715 Northwest Plaza Drive in St. Anne. Down in South County, you can apply at 4546 Lee Mayer Fair Road. And out in West County, you can go to 74 Clarkson Wilson Center in Chesterfield. Just so you'll know, the county will not accept mail or dropped off paper applications and only one member per household needs to apply. We will have a link on our website to help get you to that online application. The deadline to apply for the first year of this program is June 30th of 2025. County officials expect some 100,000 people to apply for the freeze by that deadline. We will see what County Executive Page has to say about all of this a little bit later this morning, that news conference set for 10 a.m. For now, live in Clayton, Chris Renier, Fox News.